Hi, my name is Zulkanami Vairos from class F1 T3. Today, I want to discuss about past year chapter 4, question 12. Let's go! Okay, today we will discuss about the question 12. Okay, draw and draw and explain the structure of pH3, H3 and pH3 using valence shell electron pair repulsion theory. Also show the overlapping of orbital in the pH3 molecule. So we we have two questions here. Okay, before that we must explain the valence shell electron pair repulsion theory. Electron pair around the center atom will repel one another and arrange the themselves as the far apart as a possible from each other. This is minimize the electron pair repulsion around the center atom. The order of the order of strength of the electron pair electron pair repulsion is a lone pair lone pair is stronger than lone pair bonding pair is stronger than bonding pair bonding pair. Lone pair the of the electron repulsion order electron pair more stronger than bonding pair electron because the region in the space occupied by the lone pair electron is smaller and closer to the nucleus of an atom. You will get one mark here and one mark here for the exam for the explaining. Okay, we go for the questions. So you must explain in the table for for easy to compare. Okay, the Lewis structure of BH3 this is this the Lewis structure of BH this and the Lewis structure of NH3 is this. The Lewis structure of BH3 is this. You can you know N and P in the same group in the periodic table. So have a one lone pair, one lone pair because the valence electron is five and five for both set. For both atom, not for both element. But the Lewis structure for both at both element is same. So you will get one mark here, one mark here, and one mark here. Okay. So electron pair. It's just you can calculate from the Lewis structure. So it, that is, that is important to your draw the Lewis structure correctly. So you have three bonding pair for BH3, three bonding pair and one lone pair for NH3, and three bonding pair and one lone pair for, for BH3. So we get my one mark here, one mark here, and one mark here. So the, this two is a bonus mark for you. Because if you correct for the V structure, automatically the two this you will correct. So for VSEPR, you must explain about the repulsion only. So the repulsion of BH3 is bonding pair, bonding pair, or bond pair, bond pair repulsion. For NH3, bond pair, bond pair repulsion, long pair, long pair repulsion. For PH3, bond pair, bond pair, long pair, bond pair repulsion. You will get mark one here, one here, and one here. So today is nine mark here. So we go for the molecular molecular geometry. For BH3, you must explain the uh, for molecular geometry. First of all, you must explain the electron arrangement and the molecular shape. So for BH3, the electron pair arrangement is trigonal planar. The molecular shape is trigonal planar also. So this is the shape molecular geometry. NH3 and BH3 both are same, so the electron pair arrangement are tetrahedral for NH3 and trigonal uh, molecular shape is trigonal pyramidal for NH3. It's all so the shape will be like this. And for one lone pair. For BH3 is also tetrahedral for electron arrangement, electron pair arrangement, and molecular shape is trigonal pyramidal. What is the this is the molecular geometry. So, this bond angle is the bonus mark for us because why? If you know the, uh, you draw the molecular geometry correctly, you can get the correct degrees. So the bond angle is one hundred twenty degrees. The NH uh, for BH three is one hundred twenty degrees. For NH three is less than one hundred nine point five degree. 
for pH rate is less than 100.9 degrees. So you will get one mark here for the molecular geometry and you will get one mark here for the this molecular geometry for and you will get one mark here for the molecular geometry of pH3. So the bond angle for LH3 you will get one mark here, one mark here and one mark here. Totally is six mark here. Okay, so we got uh, another uh, the another questions. So for the over overlapping orbital for pH three molecule. Okay, so first you must total the electron pair is four because pH three have one lone, one lone pair and three bonding pair. Plus you will get four electron pair. For second you must state the type of hybridization is sp three because one plus three. So sp three. So after that you must state the center atom and state the ground state and excited state and hybrid state. For pH for atom P we don't need to state the excited state. So the ground ground state is here TS 3S 3P and hybrid state is SP3. So you can check you have one lone pair and three bonding pair. So it's correct. So after that you must state the terminal atom of H. So ground state. 1s and f1 bond pair only so you must equal so you must have three atom hydrogen to equal the bonding pair of ph fp only you will get one mark here and you will get one mark here for the ground state hybrid state and ground state and the station of total electron pair and then you will get one mark here so this is the overlapping orbital of pH three. So you have one lone pair here. This is the orbital of P sp three, and you have one uh, hydrogen, hydrogen atom overlapping here. So you get one here for the correct drawing of overlapping orbital. That's it. Thank you. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe, like. Share.